Good morning, and uh, thank you all for coming to this uh, fairly early in the morning event. It's wonderful to see all of Maureen's family here, Mike, sister Carol, daughter Dawn, Tony and Anya, all the great friends and colleagues, great to see you here. Our president, Megan Hughes, is here. Thank you for coming, Megan. It's a deed and honor for me. I'm Peter Woodbury, for those of you who don't know me, at the Dean of Business, Science, and Technology. And um, it's been my honor to work with uh, Maureen McGarry for 26 years at the college. As most of you know, we were kind of connected at the hip, um, <laughs> because we're very close friends, colleagues, uh, both professionally and great confidants. Um, Maureen uh, was hired, as most of you know, in uh, August of 1988 as the Assistant Dean of Nursing and Allied Health and became the Dean of Health and Rehabilitative Sciences in July of 1994. Of course, that title changed a few times. She was Allied Health and Nursing and then Thank Dean of, uh, so I skipped some interim things, but she was the Dean of Health and Rehabilitative Sciences uh, starting in July of 1994. <clears throat> While she traveled the state overseeing CCRA's health programming at numerous locations, uh, CCRA's programming uh, at the Newport campus, uh, starting with the satellite at uh, Newport Hospital, uh, was really uh, under her tutelage and guidance. Uh, so she grew the uh, college's satellite campus at the Newport Hospital, and then in 2005, uh, upon the completion of the, uh, this campus, the Newport campus, she played a pivotal role in uh, relocating the healthcare programs to this campus. As most of you know, Maureen had a significant presence in the healthcare community. She was a valued member of numerous professional organizations and advisory groups, so she was well known throughout, New, uh, throughout Rhode Island and New England. Maureen was the ultimate professional in my mind. She was always interested in learning, always professionally active, always growing. With this, this significant level of contribution to CCRI and especially her leadership role in establishing health and rehabilitative programming at this site, it is especially meaningful that we take this time to honor her with a plaque, which those of you have not been able to view is right around the corner here, which is in clear view of the bench, which is also dedicated to her right outside the window. And the tree that we decided to give her as well. <laughs> <laughs> so th this is clearly the Dr. Maureen McGarry little square right oh. here, both inside and out. <laughs> and before I move on to Kim to uh, continue on, I wonder if <clears throat> President Hughes, if you would like to just welcome and say hello. I'll just say what feels truest. Um, it is so clear she was such a friend to you. And, um, I consider you a dear friend, and so I know what that must feel like. I know what you are feeling, and um, I have a very strong sense what she has done for this college, what she has built, and I give you my word, I will make sure we sustain that and grow it, and it's really an honor to be here. Thank you. Thank you. Let me uh, turn this over um, to Kim Pruley Rouillet, who most of you also know has um, been a long-term friend, and she is the chair of the Rehabilitative Health Programs here at the college, and so, Kim, Thank I'll you. let you take it from here. Thank you. Um, as all of you know, uh, Dean Maureen McGarry had a very, very strong presence in the healthcare community and was very influential in terms of developing the health sciences programs at the community college and working in conjunction with the other colleges within the state. Um, she had such, such a strong influence and presence in that way. Um, and not just there, but especially in Newport. She started out in Newport, and she helped to develop the Newport, um, the Newport Health Science Programs. Um, and we thank her and think about her every day. When we started out the Health Science Programs in Newport, we started out at the satellite at Newport Hospital in a nursing dorm. <clears throat> and we adapted that space, and we made that space work to the best of our abilities um, while, while that's all that we had. And then that just also made us appreciate so much more 
when we were able to come into this brand new shiny space and um, start our labs here. And once we moved into this space, all of our programs grew even more. So with the dedication of um, the Health Sciences Wing, which houses all the labs for the physical therapist assistant, occupational therapy assistant, nursing, therapeutic massage, and optician reprograms, these, all of these programs are here because of her. And um, so we look every day on that, and this um, dedication and this wing will remind us every day of the contributions and commitments that she had to the faculty, the staff, and the students at CCRI, but also especially on the Newport County campus. And now I think Joe Arsenault would like to hobble up here and say a few <laughs> words. <laughs> All right, uh, everybody, thank you. I just, uh, I had a few moments I just wanted to share with you. Uh, we've started a scholarship in Dean McGarry's name uh, here at CCRI in the foundation, and it's gonna benefit all the students in the CCRI Health Science and Rehabilitative Science programs. And uh, it's gonna be something that was dear to her heart. I know she, uh, she believes in students. She, I mean, she mentioned me as a student, and I'm gonna try to keep it together on this, I'm sorry. Uh, but anyways, it's going to be an academic-based scholarship. And that way, I know sometimes financial aid, some students are able to get those things. But I know in her heart, there's those students that, you know, they're, they're struggling, they're working, they're trying to go through it. And, you know, they're doing the great grades, and this will benefit them. <coughs> and uh, it's a perpetual scholarship, and I hope that all of you could please take a chance to donate. Uh, it's going to be online. We're going to advertise it through CCRI, but it'll go through the CCRI Foundation. And uh, I just pray for your support, and uh, I thank, thank for the deed.